I paid $20 for this bag on sale. Hi you guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Takiya G. I make content about fashion, fitness, and lifestyle. So if you're new, make sure you subscribe. And if you're returning, welcome back. Today we're gonna be making one of my absolute favorite videos. Well, one of my favorite categories. We're gonna be talking about luxury on a budget. I see you guys really enjoyed my last video. So I think I'll continue doing that. Plus I don't believe you have to break the bank to be glamorous. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys my top five favorite flat bags for under $100. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Before we get into this video, y'all, get into my old Hollywood glamour look. I'm like so obsessed with this look. But yeah, anyways, now let's get into the video. So the first bag I'm gonna start with is my Kurt Geiger medium flat bag. I've only had her for about a month, but she has literally became my favorite purse of all time as of right now out of my flat bag collection. It's a cute tweed material and it also has the cute stone details on it. Everything was perfectly placed on this bag and the chains are literally very sturdy. So I'm going to give you guys a close up of her. Let me show you the inside. It's pretty spacious for me. It fits everything. I know you guys seen my what's in my bag video. If you haven't, I hope you do go check that out. But this bag is extremely spacious. It fits everything for me. Now let me give y'all a close up. So yeah, so you have the high quality chains. I love these thick chains. You guys can see that. And then on the inside of the strap, it's real leather. So it's not gonna be any popping on you anytime soon. And you can easily make this into a long crossbody if you need it to. I'm not really into that. I just hold my bags like this. I don't really put my bags on my shoulder. But if you are interested in like making it crossbody you could show y'all it as a crossbody you can make it as a cute crossbody you can easily just wear it like this I just like to wear my bags like this regular and this is a close-up y'all look at the details and like the camera's not picking up how sparkly the the stones are in the bag it's like really really sparkly they used a really high they used a high quality, they used a high quality stone on this. I mean, it's picking it up a little bit, but it's like really, really sparkly and high quality in person. And look at the detail on the bird. Like, that's so good. And look at the stitching. Now let me show y'all the back of the bag. It does have the logo on the back. This bag was $70. I got it on sale from Nordstrom. I hope it is still in stock. If not, I'll go ahead and link another gorgeous Kurt Geiger bag for you. For you. But um, he's literally the GOAT for flat bags. Like I love everything about his bags. He also has a really cute leather flat bag on his website with silver metal. I think I'm gonna go ahead and get that as well. But yeah, you guys, this bag was $70 on sale for me. I think the original price was only like $170, though, so that's not bad for a high-quality flat bag that can be worn in a ton of different ways. Okay, so next up, I have this gorgeous royal blue flat bag. I love this bag. Well, I'll definitely say I love all of my flat bags. Like, flat bags are my absolute favorite style of bags to wear. So, yeah, I have this royal blue Donna Karen flat bag, which is absolutely gorgeous. And it is 100% genuine leather. Let me show you guys the inside. It's enough room. It has enough room for me. But one thing I don't like about this bag is it is super duper stiff this bag is so stiff and I think I've only worn it about three times but every time I worn it it was definitely a staple everyone always falls in love with this bag so let me show it to you guys up close see how high quality that is see how that is made that is literally top notch on the quality and it did come with a really cute dust bag I forgot to mention the Kurt Geiger one also came with a really cute dust bag. So yeah, this is 
so cute. This bag was, I believe, $120, but I got it on sale for $80, which was a steal for me. And it does, and it does have the silver hardware. The hardware is a lot thinner than the Kurt Geiger bag, but it's not that bad. And then I do have a keychain in the front if I wanted to make it into a keychain, but I'm good on that. And it does get long. So as I told you guys before, this can also be a side a cross body bag. Okay, that's cute. And it does have a convenient pocket in the back. But as I mentioned to you guys, this bag is so stiff, but it does have a pocket in the back, a small pocket. This bag does have good room. It just it's hard for it to extend because you guys know leather is super duper stiff. Bag is definitely a steal. It's definitely a statement piece for me. It can be worn in all seasons and it's definitely a color blocking piece. I literally love this bag. This bag will literally dress any outfit up and just add a pop of glam to anything. So yeah. Next, I have my Aldo Trebeth bag. I love this bag. This has easily become my, you know, just throw on to go to the store bag because as you guys can see, it does have the gorgeous black hardware, so it goes with everything. And it is a black bag. You know, you can't go wrong with a black bag. Flat bags, my favorite style of style bag. This bag is literally high quality. I don't believe it's real leather though, but it is high quality. It's extremely heavy that is one con about this bag it is super duper heavy and the straps are kind of on the long side but let me go ahead and show you guys the inside of this bag oh yeah and the outside is like a animal material i do have the other one the green wall i was going to show it to you guys but that bag is, it just went through a lot. So I decided to just keep that off camera, but I'll go ahead and link both at the bottom. This bag was $60. It never goes on sale. So yeah, $60. They usually always have the Trebest, this one, and also the Greenwall in stock. This is definitely, out of all, out of all of my bags, I would definitely say this is the one that you should have. This is like, the most convenient bag ever. It looks classy and it makes everything look put together and it's really big. Like I always get a lot of room in this bag. Let me show you guys. Ooh, some mess in there. Excuse the inside. I switch my bags like every single day. So I do have some lollipops in there and my AirPods that I've been looking for. So yeah, this is the inside. You get two large pockets let me show y'all the other side so it looks small on camera but this bag is extremely big like this bag gets it done i literally carry everything in this bag y'all thought i was bad on my what's in my bag video this is the worst this carries way more things in it so let me go ahead and show you guys the detail it does have the animal skin detailing on the outside and it's extremely high quality. The chains are really, really heavy. And just like the Kurt Geiger, it does have the thicker chains, which is good. And the black metal is just a plus for me. Because you guys know it looks so tacky if you don't match your metals. Let me show you guys how it goes. It's really long. This bag is really long, so I went ahead and made it double. So this is how it looks. And let me show you guys the, uh, the real length. Okay, so this is the real length of the bag. It's pretty long. It falls pretty far on me. It's really cute. It's a staple. You guys can see it. Don't look too bad with this outfit either. It's just a bag that you can throw on with anything. And if you didn't want it that long, you can also. I see some people make this into like a just a top handle bag. So yeah, this is the bag. Really cute, really convenient. This is one of my babies. This is gonna be in my collection forever and ever. Every time they mess up, I buy another one. So definitely go pick this up from Aldo. Any Aldo, it's Aldo everywhere. So make sure you pick this up or just order it online. It's gonna be linked below. So yeah.
Not much people know this, but Victoria's Secret does sell bags. I paid $20 for this bag on sale. I love this bag. Um, it does come in handy. You do need a gray bag, you know? It's not one of my fav it's not one of my all-time favorite flat bags, but it does get the job done. Um this bag is not real leather. It was not made with real leather. But it's still a good bag. It is on the smaller side, but it fits everything for me. So let me show you guys this bag up close. It's kind of out of shape. I wore it a lot. But every time I wear this bag, I get so many compliments. And it does have the gunmetal chains. Not on the thick side either. You guys can see it's not really on the thick side, but it does come in handy. As far as room on this bag, it gets the job done for me. Excuse the insides, you guys. I literally like switch my bags every day, so it's like stuff left in every single bag. It does come in handy. It does have the cute stitching in the front, very minimal, and then it has the Victoria's Secret logo. So I do get some wears out of her, but since I have my Trebeth bag from Auto, I wear that bag the most. I've gotten a good amount of wears out of her. She's definitely a casual day bag. And it's not that long, but of course, like the others, it can be a shoulder bag. It's really cute. This bag is definitely a lighter bag, and it is a bag that can be worn with anything more on the casual side. So yeah, I still love her, even though I don't wear her much anymore. And next, I do have my Guess flat bag. I like this bag as well. It is on the smaller side compared to all of the bags that I've shown you guys. Um, I've gotten this bag from Guess, the actual Guess store, and it was $40. I believe it was the faux leather, but it was well made. Um, it was well made, it feels really good. And it does have the silver chains on it. Let me show it to you guys up close. One thing I can say I don't like about this bag is the huge guest logo. I'm not big on having logos on my things. So this is one thing I do not like about this bag is the big logos. But it does come in handy. It is a sleek white bag. Show it to you guys. So it is that texture material if you can see that texture faux leather material and it does have the black stitching the minimal black stitching she's pretty she looks small but it's pretty spit it's pretty spacious and you do get a small and you do get a small pocket in the front the inside is oh let me I'm gonna try to show you guys the inside but I, I was actually using this bag so I was actually using this bag, so you might not get a good picture of it. She's pretty spacious, and she does come in handy. The chains are on the skinnier side. But it's still a durable bag. I believe I think I had this bag for about a year. I think I had this bag for about a year. And it can also be a side bag as well. really cute so yeah I do feel like this is a this was worth it because it is a white bag and it does go with a lot of things I feel like that is essential so yeah Flat bags literally elevate any look. I feel like it adds a classy touch to any outfit. So every girl should definitely have one. You don't have to break the bank to look luxurious. So yeah. So comment below, let me know what you thought about this video. Let me know which bag was your fave. And also let me know what other flat bags I was missing. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.